What is happening and welcome to another four wheel drive talk episode and friends you're gonna need to buckle up because it is time for a new edition of four wheel drive talk. Now we're gonna kick things off today by taking a look at an exciting new bed rack system from Kuat that offers incredible flexibility and functionality for your orbiting adventures. Then we're gonna jump over uh, an upcoming partnership between GMC and Earth Cruiser that's gonna make an absolute epic Hummer EV pickup overlanding rig. And let's be real here, what's not to like about a Hummer overlanding concept? And then we're gonna close things off with Enyos, which happens to be in the news as well, with word that it has plans to give a incredible Grenadier a smaller electric sibling in the not too distant future. Now, of course, we're gonna dive into all of these stories here in just a moment, but first, friends, look, creating videos like this ain't no cake work, folks. So if you're digging the blood, sweat, and tears that are put into creating these masterpieces, go ahead and annihilate that like button like it owes you money. And uh, oh yeah, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel because it's like sending me a virtual high five and man, I absolutely dig high fives. And as a small furry token of my gratitude, feast your eyes on this meerkat chilling out like he owns the place. So thank you very much for your ongoing support. We really do appreciate it. That said, let's get on to this week's headlines. Now, if you're a cyclist, a kayaker, or a skier, the chances are that you've seen a quick rack at the parking lots and at the trailheads. Heck, chances are you may have one of these things yourself. Quick Gear is known for being high-end, beautifully designed, and extremely functional. And now these characteristics are coming to the overlanding space with today's launch of Quick's Ibex truck bed rack system. Now, what makes this truck bed system newsworthy is that it offers incredible level of customization. The system includes multi-t channels for attaching accessories, and there are full and half height options, so you can tailor the rack system to your specific needs. Now, Quick provides telescoping crossbars that mount to the top of the frame while also giving you a laundry list of accessories like for example molly panels that are compatible with mass tracks and rotopacks a uh, high lift jack mount and a antenna mount on top of that so you really do have a lot of flexibility here now other accessories include a shovel axe holder a retrax mount and a bottle opener to name a few so these guys really left no stone left unturned now the object system comes with ballistic black powder coat that gives the rack a really sleek and modern look, but also more importantly, the black powder coating ensures that the rack has a long-term durability in the Hausch outdoor environments. Now this system is made from aluminum, so it is lightweight, yet it has a 600 pound dynamic weight capability for on-road adventures and a 300 pound dynamic weight capacity for off-roading. Now the system also has a 1200 pound static weight capacity as well. Now Ibex is built around a open hoop design, so this this is going to give you easy side bed access. It's compatible with uh, Tacoma, Tundra, or uh, Frontier Titan pickups. And if you happen to be like me driving a Gladiator, you're gonna be happy to know that the Ibex system is coming later on this year for us. Now, as you know, if you've watched my channel in the past, I'm constantly preaching about space is a big premium when you're out overlanding, which is why this system is so valuable. You can carry a lot of gear and do so in a very organized, functional, and safe way. And Let's be real, what's not to like about that? Now pre-orders have begun, so if you want to snag one of these bad boys up for your truck, I'm going to put a link in the description over to Kuat. Now the word on the street is that GMC is teaming up with Earth Cruiser to make a Hummer EV pickup that is loaded with features for overlanding. Yeah, hell yeah, this thing sounds badass. Now the vehicle will initially be offered as a add-on for the Hummer EV pickup and will supplement the Hummer EV's already excellent off-road capabilities with next level overlanding features that enable you to really go far off grid and stay out there for a while. Now if you aren't familiar with Earth Cruiser, they make some absolutely epic overlanding vehicles like the EXP that's on your screen. Now these vehicles allow you to stay off grid for long periods of time mainly because they have enormous fuel tanks, 60 gallons in fact. Now obviously the Hummer EV pickup 
doesn't need a 60 gallon fuel tank, but what it does need is a way for charging up its batteries when shore power isn't available. Now, the obvious solution to that issue is to outfit the truck with solar panels. Now, the teaser image that you're looking at right now appears to show what looks like solar panels on the roof and on the sides. Now, unfortunately though, no other details are apparent in the teaser image and GMC and Earth Cruiser haven't quite let the cat out of the bag about the truck's features as well. However, the good side of this, we're not gonna have to wait long uh, for the concept truck to be ready and roll out and where we can get more details about this interesting rig. Now, GMC and Earth Cruiser have a late summer 2023 date for this unveiling. Now remember the Enyos Grenadier? We've talked about it a number of times in the past and I've raved about it being a modern day take on a classic Land Rovers. Now the SUV, man, these things look pretty awesome. They have the ability to easily tackle even the most difficult trails, but the Grenadier isn't going to be the only model for long. Not only is Angus working on a hydrogen electric Grenadier, but it also recently announced that it will work with Magna to produce a all electric SUV that will debut in 2026. Now the new SUV, which doesn't have a name yet, will be a smaller than the Grenadier, which let's be real here, that's not gonna be hard to do because the Grenadier, it's a big truck, 191 inches long, 76 inches wide, and 80 inches tall. So there's plenty of fat to trim off that thing. Now, there aren't many details about the new uh, EV SUV, but Enyos insists that it will deliver world-class off-road capability. And that's where Magna comes in. Now, Magna is a Austrian company that has been making four-wheel drive vehicles for decades. And Magna's location allows for rigorous off-road testing that will aid in making the new SUV an off-road beast. In fact, think about it here. The new Enyos model will be tested on the same mountain facility as the Mercedes G-Wagon, which of course is one of the most capable off-roaders ever made. But Enyos is not stopping with the smaller electric SUV. Instead, the company has plans to release a pickup by the end of this year. Oh yeah, heck yeah, especially if that pickup makes it to the US soil, which would be a lot of fun. Now stay tuned for updates on these new models. If anything like the Grenadier, these are going to be some very exciting vehicles to watch for. All right, friends, and that is it for me. Normally this time of the video, I'd be jibber jabbering about our current giveaway, but that has ended. So what you're gonna wanna do is stay tuned for the next episode where we are going to crown the winners of the last giveaway and also identify the new giveaway moving forward. But before we go jumping off this video, I do have to thank you for supporting the channel by watching this video, because you know, let's face it, YouTube, there is a ton of other options that, that could be grabbing your attention or taking your time right now. And the fact that you've given us a few moments, we are quite appreciative of that. And so if you have not already, please consider hitting the like button, subscribe button, and last but not least, so therefore you don't miss a single video just like the one that you just watched, uh, be certain to hit the little bell for all notifications. But that is, yeah, that's officially all I have. So friends, I'm gonna be showing up these cameras so you get out there, stay healthy, and find your adventure.